good afternoon everyone welcome to tv5 and uh, mana tv viewers right now we are in atlanta in uh, shakti mandir uh, which is uh, south of uh, atlanta and today we have uh, our guruji ishan shivanand ji so we have uh, a wonderful event going on on the art of uh, uh, self realization we welcome and it's our honor to uh, have spent some time with you and learn today whatever the event you have done it's really really helpful tell us about what made you to come to atlanta today. i was invited we have a very good and thriving community here and uh, the community felt that they can benefit especially the young children can benefit from learning our ancient indian knowledge systems and they invited me and i'm very grateful to come here and meet thank you ishan ji today's world is very fast the social media and the 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 speed which which we are going is very fast and when you especially focused on mental health right it is very very important today so how do you think the youth today in north america especially what is your advice on the mental health how to keep intact see whenever we are living there is a intrinsic cost to living if i want to live in a big house i have to pay the tax in the same manner if i want to live this life in north america tax is mental and that cost need to be paid because if we don't pay then what will happen just like the government repossesses in the same manner our you know the, the the anxiety or the trauma it just takes over us it repossesses then we are in our body but we are not in our body that is what we say mental health issues that that we have lost ourselves we are repossessed by that thing that has taken over in our mind so if you want to live here then the cost of living here is we have to bring in our life sadhana the art of meditation the beautiful indian knowledge systems because they teach us living fast is 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 not bad absolutely it is good it is important we need to live fast we need to make value we need to help the community we need to help the economy but at the same time we need to have tools to deal with this pace and that is what i try to do i give these children these tools and when they have it they feel that they have a new life and they are very very grateful and they are little sad also because they are thinking why our parents did not teach us this why in school we are not taught this and imagine if mental health education became part of education and maybe that is our end goal absolutely